Hello everyone, it's me, Amber Please, and welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I make my thumbnails for my Roblox YouTube videos. Just before I start, make sure to subscribe, comment, like, and turn on the notification bell to get notified every time I post a new video. And also make sure to comment any questions or any ideas for next videos. I am working on a really big video that is related to Halloween. It's going to be more of like a role play type of thing and it will take a while so make sure to be prepared for that and without further ado I guess let's get right into the video. So the app that I use is called Photopedia Photopia. This is a free app where you can make literally any uh, Roblox or just generally any Photoshop that you like for free. So you can make a name. Let's make this a, a Roblox tutorial. We can do that. And you can either choose transparent. So transparent is like this. White background is white background. So usually, uh, you so if you want to have a cool background, you have to use um, you have to use um, this one. So you can find any background that you want, and you can attach it right here. To that. Um, and sometimes when it doesn't work out, we can always redo it. Um, okay. Um, okay, that looks actually pretty good. And and you can find different pets. For example, I want to use my hmm, my neon kit kit soon. I did so sometimes. Uh, so when you're making a really uh, when you're making um, thumbnails, sometimes when you have like a pet that you want to use, you have to cut uh, edit um, crop out the 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 pic, crop out some of it so it's much easier to remove. So when I was actually trying to remove the background, I had really lots of trouble, and I want to help you guys if you're using this app. What you're going to do is you're going to search up magic wand. There you go. And after, you're going to press rasterize, and now you can literally press on the stuff that you want to delete, and it will delete for you. Um, just have to be a little more careful sometimes where you press because you want to mostly get rid of these lines um let's try again just need to and when you do it you have to press backspace if you're wondering it's backspace um so what you can do is you're literally just gonna photoshop like that um uh, okay um, depends on what computer you have. Um, that's how you can edit it better. So, for example, I have this uh, pet that I want to edit, but I don't like these like little lines, and it takes too long, and it doesn't really work. You can go to your files, go to your files, open this up, and if you have a Windows, and I'm pretty sure you can only do it with Windows, you can edit with a Paint 3D. And uh, what it will do. So what it will do is that you can change the background. You go to that and then you press the background and it makes your whole background white. Instead of spending so much time just on honestly um trying to oh sorry trying to um get rid of just a little splotch or something like that you can easily do it with this app um sorry not app uh, it's free on your computer so when you download a windows if you when you get a, down, a windows computer that's what it can do so sometimes it's a little like that so it doesn't always work but it's really easy just to when you actually do your photoshop it's very much it's much easier to um, Photoshop around, um, you can still f uh, uh, Photoshop anyways around this uh, all the stuff that you don't like. Oh, sorry, my bad. That was an accident. Um. 
so just like so and you can if you are a perfectionist like myself you can go and literally fill in each pixel uh, let's try one more time with this one oh, okay so it doesn't work that's fine so when you have this you take your and take a screenshot but of course we can name this a uh, neon kit soon like that so now once we go back to our photoshop we can delete delete this go to the back to this little mouse button and we can place our new neon kit sune so how to do this is you can extra you can make it as wide as you want and you can place it anywhere you want so you press that and then you take your magic wand, which when you um, kind of delete some stuff, it will always have your magic wand option right over here. So you can totally ignore that. But every time you have to start, the button will not be there. So you press backspace for all of this stuff to delete all the background and stuff like that that you do not want. And then with the rest of your magic wand, you can just fully go over it with um just delete every part that you don't do not like for example these little lines i'm not a big fan of that so we can go ahead and delete that um this is a much easier way and m not even expensive i like how i said expensive um so yes so um as you can tell we might have we accidentally probably i didn't see it but we probably accidentally i think um deleted the tail uh, which is kind of weird. Um, um, oh, sorry, that's the wrong one. So sometimes you have these accidents that I happen that occur. Occur. I um, mean, if you guys are looking at my files that say mom and stuff, that's for my mom. That was Valentine's Day, and yes, I got her. I made her a Photoshop and a video. And if you guys want to know how to make a free video using a Windows laptop, make sure to comment that down below, and that will be the next video. Oh, because the kids suit. Okay, so what it does is it actually removes the tail color. So if you have like a background that kind of looks the same color, this won't matter. But if you really are annoyed by this, you can take it and choose a, the exact color. You use this. Uh, oh. And take your pencil and just kind of copy that shape right there. And just fill it in a little bit. And then just like so. You're going to grab it and you're going to and there you go it looks a little fake um, it looks a little odd sometimes but all I have to do is fix it up and you'll be good to go just like so and yeah this is so you can always take another screenshot screenshot you just have to press on the screen with your uh, the right click um, let's uh, just, uh, oh excuse me Okay, just randomly so instead now it should work uh, even I'm having a little issue sometimes with using this um, sorry um, it's not generally it's not with this app but it is the fact that it's a little different it's quite difficult to generally make thumbnails um, it takes a lot of skill and you know photoshopping skills too so if you ever have any um, issues or any more questions, uh, just comment it down below, and I could, and I will make, I will make a video about it. See now, there you go. That's much better. See, so now you can actually the tail is still there, and it actually looks perfectly blend in. This is you can only you should only do this when you really need to, so it doesn't look really weird because it's a different type of color. Uh, it's a it's the same color as that but it doesn't look as glowy and there is I don't um, and you can oh 
and this uh, this is called uh, this is this uh, is come it's for free in your computer it's called paint 3d um, if you actually have it on, on like an Apple or something like that then definitely use it the other best part about it is, is that honestly you could um, let me do this one more time uh, undo we can undo everything so the best part about this uh, thing that you can do is you can actually color I want the kids oh wait sorry my bad you can make the tails look different and just generally color the parts that you don't like sometimes this is really annoying you just have to um, but it's really good for like trying to help you out we're okay so there you go this is your final product um, and I think it looks pretty cool um, and yeah so without further ado we're going to show I'm going to show you one more thing that you can do so when I am making um, sometimes when you have a pet it actually comes with this type of screen so that means that it um, you don't need to um, you don't need to um, make it uh, Photoshop it out you can just place it wherever you want for example like this photo over here so you can make it really small um, like that and then you can also con if you don't like something you can still move it sorry sometimes this does that so yeah this is the app that I use and I think you guys should definitely use it too and yeah and if you guys have any other questions let me know and you can make for example I can show you guys a really cool one that I made um, sorry it is where is it these right here I made this one on the app this app so again my photoshop's photoshopping uh, skills improved so there is no, none of the green stuff here anymore jelly bean is perfectly fine here lime for lima bean and um, I am making a neon triceratops so that's going to be really cool but yeah this is literally what you can do and you can crop it and you can actually do lots and lots of things with these app with this app called photopia.com um, and yeah and it is actually a browser so you don't have to download it on your computer you can just search it up and it will work for you um, and yes so I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and hopefully you guys found it very helpful um, of how I actually make my Photoshop for free and always I'm always going to be improving my photoshopping skills so yeah, if you guys are ever need any questions or anything, just comment them down below and don't forget to subscribe. And again, as I was saying, I will be making a really cool Halloween video um, roleplay in Adopt Me. Um, and it's going to take me some time. But if you guys have any other questions, make sure to comment them down. So without further ado, guys, 